What's up YouTube, Electric Cakes here, back at it again with another video and today we have something different. We're going to be going over two sneakers this time. Uh, I consider them part of a pack, not quite sure what I'm going to call the pack yet, but it's going to be a pair of Nike Dunk Lows. Uh, it's going to be a women's sizing Nike Dunk, both made out of a very, very nice material. I believe the name for this one right here is the nike dunk low premium prm pink oxford and then the one right over here is the women's nike dunk low prm for premium in the neutral olive so very very nice colors i will say these shoes are going to be perfect especially for like the summertime the springtime once it stops raining feel like these are going to be very very nice especially if you like a more neutral toned down look to your outfits these are going to be very good options but so let's go ahead and get into it both the sneakers came in just regular nike boxes right here let's see uh both of these are going to be a size seven and then here's going to be the other one same exact boxes no special paper none of that and they retailed i believe at 120 in terms of the resale, I just want to go ahead and get that out of the way. They're not reselling for anything. They're actually going for under retail. So if you're interested in picking up a pair, uh, look online. They may still have a couple pairs restocking here and there. Check your local foot store. So your foot locker, your champs. And also check with local resellers. A lot of them probably have a, a lot of these pairs and they're probably not going for much. They're probably selling it at retail, maybe. 20 bucks over 30 bucks over which is going to be a very good deal so if you're interested in these sneakers definitely go and get them now but let's go get started it's going to be the pink oxford dunk all over with that pink oxford starting out with the outsole we have that pink oxford outsole midsole regular nike midsole with the white now the upper is where it gets interesting it's going to be a new buck all over the upper very similar to the lightning force just not as good in material but i will say overall still pretty nice for the retail of this shoe now going on to the swoosh this is where the material changes it's going to be a very smooth leather and it feels very synthetic so the quality isn't really there for this sneaker but we do have that leather also on the back tab with the nike on there as well moving on to just the rest of the upper as you can see it's gonna be that new book and the thing is you know it's new book or this might be durabuck no it's new book so it's not gonna be synthetic and we can see kind of like the creasing right there already this pair came a little bit messed up straight from sneakers so quite unfortunate but overall still pretty decent material moving on to the tag this is where it gets a little interesting we do have leather debossed on there with the nike so that's pretty cool now we do have regular laces on there now i will say these laces do feel a little bit better than your traditional nike dunk lace i feel like the quality is just a little bit better moving on to the insole and just the padding on there is going to be a lot more but we do have that matching pink insole with the nike branding on there as well other than that nothing too much to the sneaker moving on to the neutral olive pair matching outsole neutral olive white midsole and then we do have that same material as the pink ones it's going to be that green new buck all around same exact construction now on the green we do have that smooth leather swoosh on there going over to the back tab with the nike branding also being leather now like i said that leather feels really synthetic it's a really thin cut of leather it doesn't feel that good so I don't know why they labeled it as PRM, which stands for premium, when the materials aren't really that premium. So that's kind of one thing that I'm disappointed. Like, I wish it was a lot softer. Like, I would rather have them charge an extra $10 for the sneaker and put actual good materials on there. But overall, still a nice shoe, especially for the summertime. These two shoes right here, I can see being perfect, especially for those toned down looks and you just want something simple to go out but very very nice shoes won't be able to do an on feet unfortunately because these are not my size but hopefully you guys enjoyed 
the review uh, one more thing I want to add sizing sizing for the sneakers go true to size Nike dunks fit true to size so if you're a seven women's get a seven women's it's gonna fit you even if you're slightly on the wider side I feel like Nike dunks can be a little bit loose so uh, I think that's gonna be perfect but yeah hopefully you guys enjoyed and catch you guys on the next one peace